All new at 530, here's something you don't see every day. A local lawmaker cleaning up part of his district all by himself. We're talking about South District Councilman Christopher Scanlon. And his give back attitude, neighbors say, fits this community to a T. Businesses and homeowners coming together to take back their community one vacant lot at a time. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Christy Maria takes us to South Buffalo tonight. I'm very passionate about the neighborhood. It's not just a job for me, but it's also my neighborhood. I'm extremely passionate about it. Chris Scanlon is Buffalo's South District Councilman, but yesterday he was seen doing a bit of lawn care. These pictures show Scanlon cutting the lawn outside an abandoned home. He says he got a complaint about the high grass, so he decided to take care of it himself. But complaints like these, he says, are actually down significantly. This year, with the, the lack of maintenance to the properties, I don't think we've seen as many. We haven't had to go out as much this year. Scanlon says properties with notices like this are still an issue, but the number of areas in need of maintenance is down. That's thanks in large part to the community pitching in, like the development company Hook and Ladder. John Otto is one of Hook and Ladder's three owners. If it's the neighbor, if it's the guy down the street, if it's uh, the development company on Seneca Street, we're the city of good neighbors. Everyone can, uh, you know, pitch in and help. And this is the house the councilman stopped at yesterday to help tidy up. And as you can see, the grass is cut and the ground seem pretty well kept. And while there aren't that many properties that are abandoned in South Buffalo, some residents are pitching in to tidy up the ones that are. Mike Noy cuts the grass of the property that sits on the other side of that fence. It's making the place look good, so people come by. I don't think nobody lives here, and then they just park their vehicles in here. He's lived in the same house for 25 years and makes sure his area stays tidy. It's efforts like his that help reduce the number of abandoned properties that need maintenance. And those efforts, big and small, continue to make the area look that much better. And it could be something as putting a new facade on a building or it could be something as weed whacking the, on a house on a side street. In South Buffalo, Christy Maria, 7 Eyewitness News.